in an extremely significant move. The government has today decided to withdraw the controversial Armed Forces Special Powers Act from many districts in the Northeast, mainly in Assam, Nagaland and Manipur. Remember, this comes after the renewed opposition to AFSPA after last year's Nagaland firing in which 14 young men were killed in a botched army operation. Political parties had made this a major election plank, including in recent elections in Manipur. So today, the Home Minister announced major lifting of this Armed Forces Special Powers Act in many districts. In a single tweet by the Home Minister, a major announcement, the footprint of the controversial Armed Forces Special Powers Act reduced in three northeastern states. A closer look reveals that this is a partial withdrawal. In Assam, AFSPA has been withdrawn in 23 districts. In Nagaland, it has been withdrawn in areas under 15 police stations in seven districts. In Manipur, AFSPA has been withdrawn in areas under 15 police stations of six districts. The Home Minister pitched the rollback as a result of the improved security situation. It's a historic moment for the people of northeastern region. Lots of efforts have been put in by Prime Minister Modi ji and Home Minister Amit Shah ji to bring peace and tranquility all along northeastern region. This shows that the era of peace and development has arrived in northeastern region in true sense. But the move is seen as linked to the massive backlash after the army shot and killed 14 men in Nagaland last year in a botched operation. Regardless, chief ministers in the northeast welcomed the move. This is one of the most bold initiative. It is one of the important initiatives taken by Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Home Minister Amit Shah because it will send a signal to investor. Others say the act should have been withdrawn a long time ago. We demand to refill totally, refill totally this AFSA. This is anti-people, anti-democratic law, black law, so this should be definitely withdrawn. This move by the center is expected to create a positive momentum for the BJP in the region and also help pave way for fast-tracking the Naga peace talks as well as peace parlays with Ulfa. But the big question is, will the armed forces who had prosecution immunity due to AFSPA in alleged extrajudicial killings be now brought to justice? With Ratnadeep Chaudhary in Guwahati, Bureau Report, NDTV.